Your Lego creations are amazing. Please keep them coming. We love seeing them and they're keeping us motivated over here. Today I have some collage for you. So a lot of you know I am a painter and when I have a painting that I don't end up putting on the wall as the one, I always save them and then sometimes I'll use them to make a collage. So this is old paintings that I cut up to make a new painting that I adore. So in this one today, I used some old watercolor paintings. McKenna used jelly prints, and we're gonna show you some different ideas, but you can use whatever you want, sky's the limit. Think about newspaper, wrapping paper, maps, wallpaper, brown paper bags. So this is the jelly pad McKenna used to make her prints. She just put paint on here, layered it up, made designs, rolled it out, laid paper on, rolled paper flat, and then peeled it off. But I realize you are stuck at home and you can't just go buy a jelly pad. So one of the things we use is silicone molds. We just use the back and since we don't have a ton of these, we use a rolling pin. Works like a charm. These are some of the prints that McKenna made with her jelly pad. She just used acrylic paint. She was really feeling the dots. You can use forks and spoons and other cool, just look in your kitchen, let's say utensils, to make other patterns and layer them up. And then here is the collage that she made out of her prints. This is Claire's collage. Pretty fun. I like how she incorporated buttons and sequins. This is Alice's collage. This is Spirit of the Forest, a bear in an enchanted forest. Okay, for mine, I used my leftover watercolor and I just wanted to put this picture out there so you guys know I use photo references. I think this is one of those misconceptions about artists that we are coming up with everything from our minds but no we love our photo references it's totally cool to do this is my pile of rethink these paintings and save for later and this is what I have so far on my collage cactus bird I'll keep you posted I love how it's coming so far